Today we're going to look at changing the Windows 11 start menu to bring back some of the options that you had on the Windows 10 start menu. So let's just have a look at the good old Windows 10 start menu. So on the left hand side, down the left hand side edge there, you had the, uh, the documents folder, you had the pictures folder and the settings cog. Now if we have a look at the Windows 11 start menu, all we've got is we've just got our name there, which OK, you had that in the Windows 10, but we're missing the documents folder. We're missing the pictures folder. We're missing the settings cog. Now, OK, you've got the settings cog up there and the photos up there and you can get to the documents folder in File Explorer. But I know that a lot of people would prefer to have those particular options back. So how do you get them back on the Windows 11 start menu? So we can click on settings just up there. And then once we've clicked on settings, click on personalize just on the left. On the right there, we want to find start. So click on start. And then click on folders. And here we've got some options so we can turn settings on if we click on uh, the little switch just to the right of settings and then click on the start button. As you'll see, there you go. The settings cog has come back. Now, if we want documents on there, then we can click the little switch to the right of documents and click on that. And there you go. The documents folder appears. And what was it? Pictures. That was the other thing. We've got the pictures folder there. We can turn that on and that will now come back. So we've got pictures, documents and settings. But we've also got other folders here we can add if we wanted to. We can add our personal folder just by turning that on. And what is the personal folder? Well, when we click on the little person there, this is what we get. We get all of our folders, the desktop documents, downloads, music, pictures, videos, etc. So there we are. Now, when we click on our start button, we actually do get settings. So if we click on the settings cog there, there you go. It brings us into settings. If we click on the pictures little icon there, it brings us into the pictures folder. And if we click on the little document there, that will bring us into the documents folder. Now, if you do want to make your start button look much more like Windows 10, then I did do a video on this quite recently. So have a look in my videos. I'll put a link to it at the bottom of this video and I'll try and put a link on screen right now that you can click on. And that not only makes your start menu look more like Windows 10, but it also reverts Explorer as well if you want it to.